next, we have C and D campus maps. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Chloe Altman. And I'm Danielle Kirscher, and we'd like to welcome you to campus today, and thank you for taking the time to be here. In a survey done on the current first year class at Gustavus, we found that 86% of the, the students believe that a navigational app would enhance the overall experience for visitors on campus. Now these visitors would be family, friends, and guests of the college. Some of these individuals are the people who support and pay the tuitions of our students at Gustavus. We are the students consistently seeing this problem and constantly being asked where things are upon campus. And for this reason, CND Campus Maps was founded. CND Campus Maps provides an interactive mobile engagement experience for college campus visitors and more importantly, prospective students. The navigational app is designed to allow visitors of the college campus to become familiar with the campus in an efficient and stress-free manner. CND Campus Maps realized that navigation around college campuses can be improved immensely. Gustavus does not have an ideal navigation system. If you look in the bottom right hand of this corner, we use sandwich boards to direct our visitors around campus. <laughs> Signage and navigation around campus can be improved immensely at Gustavus. As colleges continue to compete for applicants, creating this great first impression remains a priority. And as, as of now, colleges don't really have this reliable tool for students to engage and interact while walking around campus. CD Campus Maps can solve this problem. Our app provides students with the knowledge and confidence to have while walking or driving around campus. Sydney Campus Maps will provide detailed data specific to a college campus. On the right, you will see Gustavus Maps, which will be the first customer for CND Campus Maps. And then on the left, you see Gustavus' current app, which works as a static app for prospective students and their parents, and it works as a view book to show them what Gustavus has to offer. Now, although this app works great for its target market, it doesn't address navigation or directions like Gustavus Maps has to offer. So when visitors arrive on campus, they'll be first given the option to go by foot or by vehicle. Then, the following screen will bring them to the screen on your left here, or on the left side of the screen, that will allow them to choose their destination. So the categories that they can choose from are administration and services, athletic facilities, academic facilities, parking lots, public facilities, and then residential facilities as well. So say, for example, we chose academic facilities. From here, it brings you up, move you to the second screen and bring up a list of academic buildings that are on campus. So from here, let's say we chose Beck Academic Hall. It would then bring you to this next screen with more information about that specific location. Here, we'll see building hours and majors within the building. And then the bottom button here would bring, be different per building. So for Beck Academic Hall, it'd give you professors' names and their contact information. But say we were in the cafeteria, it'd give you the lunch menu for that day. Um, and then in the upper right hand corner is also a search bar. So that will help you if you don't know specifically where your location might fit under what category, you could type in the event you're trying to attend. So for today, we could have typed in Gusty Entrepreneurship Cup and it would have directed us to Beck Hall. You could do this with Nobel, Christmas in Christ Chapel, or even any sort of event guest speaker. This app also provides clear directions for parking on campus. So if the, the parking lot by three flags over there is full today, like it might have been today, it will provide different routes on campus to just different parking lots that visitors can look for extra spots. Our app provides, allows Gustavus to bring alive the beautiful landmarks that we have through 3D images and visuals. So for each college campus who purchases our package deal, they will be able to bring the beauty of their campus alive as well. The target audience for CND Campus Maps will be prospective students and their families, alumni, like some of you who are here today, and visitors for special events, kind of like today as well. The feeling of being lost or confused for visitors on college campuses can result in poor satisfaction scores. So let's address this issue and provide a solution. Providing an improved visitor experience is likely to increase, increase prospective students interest in attending a college, which in turn can generate more revenue for a college, more increased donations, and more repeat guest visitors. Gustavus has minimal signage on campus due to preserving this historical look that we have, so the more tech-savvy approach to this issue of having no signage on campus will be to create a mobile app. Creating this navigational app will be more practical and cost-efficient than bringing signage to our whole campus. So why clutter our beautiful campus when CND Campus Maps can provide a handheld solution and we can keep the beauty of our campus alive? The target market for CND Campus Maps includes college campuses. Specifically within college campuses, we plan to approach the admissions offices. Now admissions offices are given the 
the most significant amount of a college campus budget. For this reason, we decided to approach the admissions offices. After Gus Davis, CND Campus Maps plans to approach schools within the Maya, followed by universities and colleges throughout the state of Minnesota, and continue on through the United States. In terms of sales, CND Campus Maps is offering their product at an upfront charge with an additional fee per download. This model enables us to offset the initial charge with an integration fee and then have significant upside as we get more downloads throughout over time. The addressable market for CD Campus Maps includes over 9,000 colleges and universities throughout the United States. Taking a conservative view of the market opportunity, we plan to only secure only 5% market penetration, which would generate over $50 million for our company. Not only would CD Campus Maps be profitable, we will be adding value to the overall visitor experience on each campus. For each college campus who purchases our package deal, they will be able to see the benefits on their campus as well. So let CND Campus Maps be the first to bring a navigational app to Gustavus and other colleges. CND Campus Maps is what the future holds for providing an interactive mobile engagement experience for college campus visitors. Thank Thanks. you. Questions? So I bought it yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> but there is, you do have it out there, right? Do you have something out there? There's something Not yet, because the, the initial charge for the developing the app is very expensive, so okay. we would have to do a lot of funding for that to happen. There, there's there. a Gustavus app. App. Yep, yep. that's that static app. Okay, that's that static app. Right. So, yeah, that works as like a few bucks. So, is there any other interest in, the, have you talked to anybody else yet? Any other campuses? We haven't talked to other campuses. We started, we're starting here just at Gustavus to see how we can kind of create it and see the interest we have here. I'm curious, um, with a market size that big, have you thought about a, an exit strategy for this company? <laughs> we have not thought about that just yet. <laughs> um, we're going to start with Gustavus, obviously, since we're insiders here and have the appropriate contacts. Um, and then hopefully, through some of the mentoring that we've gotten, we'll hopefully move to a campus that really needs this issue, and this issue needs to be addressed. So something that a campus university that's like a city, it's so big. So this, from there, we'll grow and think about that question more. <laughs> Yes. How did you come up with your first point of $100,000? Yeah, so um, through an expert in the market and then an iOS developer and then knowing how much it costed for the Gustavus app, we came up with how much it's, about, it's supposed to cost us to develop it, which is about $200,000. And so then we chose $100,000 to kind of offset that a little bit. Is Gustavus prepared to spend that much? <laughs> it's a it depends if we have a donor in the room. Yeah. <laughs> or two. <laughs> Can I just ask you a clarifying question? Yeah. Do you download the app once and it's for all the schools that are kind of in it, or do you have a different app for each school? Yep, so it would be a different app for each school. And it's just, it's free to the end user, so like if you were a visitor on campus, it'd be free to you. It's the school that would be paying a dollar per download. thought about integrating a safety feature in it, which might make it attractive and a possible Kickstarter attractive project? We have not thought about that either. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's definitely something to think about when we start to develop and bring in the features of the app. What, what about the, ri the range? 100,000 must be average, right? Gustavus, compact, relatively simple campus, you know, University of Wisconsin, Madison, big, complicated. What, what, how do you see the range of pricing working? That's a good question. Um, I would say that's something that we would work with our iOS developers and the, um, our mentors to see, you know, if we should start um, charging more for this package deal, like say we're at Michigan State, you know, that's a huge campus. So that might be something where we need to up the charge a little bit, maybe by size of school. Um, from a competitive perspective, we know there's a lot of mapping technology, but have you seen anything similar like this on other campuses around the country? Yes, there are currently other navigational apps. I think right now, if you would type in Gustavus on your phone in the App Store, a logical dimensions will show up. And that is what we like is one of our main competitors, but we don't see them as a threat at all because when we download it and we paid 99 cents, which was yeah. a regret, 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, it doesn't even work. Yeah. I think okay, that's well, all. That's all the time we have. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for your question.